Oh my gosh. I think we're gonna hit 69 kids today. <laughs> What's up everybody, I'm Kelsey, I'm single, and we thought it would be funny if I tried the 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have one matriarch and they are supposed to have 100 children, all with different partners. There's a lot of rules of this challenge, so if you're interested in those rules, the link will be below. Last time, Kelly aged up into a full grown adult woman. She's ready to child rear and we're ready to continue on with this challenge. So I'm excited to see what new boundaries Kelly breaks in terms of parents for her children. I've always said no to Santa, no to weird Sims. Maybe Kelly's the Sim that just throws all that out the window. Let's get our granddaughter pregnant. All right, let's get back to the Apichishme family. We're gonna give her a little makeover to start, just to, you know, make her look a little different than what she did as a teen. You don't want her to look like a teen anymore, you know what I'm saying? There she is, our queen. Oh, wow, it's so, it's so weird zooming in and it not being Casey. Let's have you, Miss Kelly, go and plan an outfit. And let's see what Kelly comes up with. Oh yeah, she's sad again. She's still in a mood swing. Girl, you gotta jump out of that. Don't be so sad. Oh no, this is a bad omen. Her face shape is very interesting. You know what's interesting is that we started with a character that looked a lot like me. Since we've had all the children, now she doesn't look like me at all. I want her to be kind of funky, you know? I want her to be kind of wild. I will admit her like lips, for some reason, her smile looks very like Joker-esque. If you put a red lip on her, she'd probably look like the Joker. Let's see, smile. Yeah, a little. You see it, right? I just want to go bold with her. I want something crazy. I think I like this. I like the rings in it. I think Kelly looks cool with it. Maybe Kelly might have some piercings. Maybe that's how we mix it up. Maybe she'll have a cute little nose ring. She's gonna have like an earring that matches the rest of the rings. I think that's pretty sick. I'm loving this actually. I'm feeling this, like she's a boho, cool, free-spirited kind of prankster, babe. Second outfit, I'm thinking another full body. I obviously like love the bohemian vibe for her. Now actually this would be what she'd wear to like the Renaissance fair, but she's not going to the Renaissance fair. None of us are going to the Renaissance fair this year. This one's kind of cute as like her version of the overalls. I like it with the purple. Cute. Kelsey's happy. Next outfit. <gasps> I forgot, we have to have a red dress. We always have a red dress. Okay, let's see what her little red dress is gonna be like. She could go like vavoom, you know? Maybe we'll just make her little red dress like this. She's cool. Yes, girl. What would she wear to a formal event? That's a little too formal for the hair now. Hair now, hair now. Party look, not that hat, girly, not that hat. Something a little more feisty. She liked it when I said feisty. She was like, oh. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty cute. This is our girl. Oh my God, I love it for her. She loves purple just like her mom. Love her new makeover. Welcome Kelly to the matriarch. So I think it's time to get her first pregnancy. It's time to take this girl out on the town. Oh wait, she's really sad. Okay, yeah, she's gonna go to bed. She's gonna sleep it off. Ooh, maybe she'll go steal something today. Oliver, he needs to get his skills up, but he really needs to just sleep. So we're gonna have Oliver sleep. Holden's looking good. So Holden, why don't you do your homework? Look at our punky boys. They are just rife with boyish energy. None of them are prepped for school today. It's Monday. Oh no, it's 7 p.m. I'm very good at reading what's going on on my Sims. I'll look at the punky twins. <gasps> They're sitting right next to each other with their matching red hair. Okay, stop distracting your brother. He needs to be doing his homework too. Kabima Bavne! Kabima Bavne! I should do a whole video where I just speak in similar. Why don't we wake Kelly up? Have Kelly make a garden salad in honor of her mother, who has not passed. She's just in a new house. She just moved out. Look at her, she's feeling great. She's like, I just had a birthday. I'm ready to accept the challenge. Oh, this is her first time cooking. Oh my gosh, here we go. This whole episode is just gonna be all of Casey's first times. First time cooking for a family. No, don't put your earwax. Don't put your earwax in the salad. That is terrible. Case okay, Kelly. <gasps> Her brother was trying to take a shower and now that he he peed his pants. So embarrassing for him. Oh, you couldn't have used the 
bathroom in here. Well, why don't you repair that then? And then Oliver, once you're done doing all of that, I think you need to mop up your mess. No, 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 don't go to bed. We're gonna go out. We're gonna go out. I know you're tired. It's fine. Let's go see who we meet when we're out. Kelly's first night out. Let's go to a new world maybe that we haven't gone to much. Let's go to see it out in San Luciano. Let's go out in the city. We'll go to like a karaoke bar maybe. That could be fun. Okay, let's go to Waterside Warble. What is it, 3 a.m., 4 a.m.? That's prime karaoke time right there. It was 2 a.m. Well, no one's here yet. We'll do a fizzy fruity drink. It's her first drink ever. She's looking fierce in her little red dress ready to find the future parent of her children. Who is this man? Oh, it's Genji. Why is Genji so mad? Ooh, but this guy, Jace. Hello, Jace. He's feeling flirty. He's got like long hair. Ask about his career, Casey. Kelly, he's a front page writer at Walrus Books. He's a writer? Ask him if he's single. Jace is single. Oh my gosh. They're really vibing. This dude in the middle, Akito's like feeling a little bit man in the middle with his tiny mustache. Look at his itty bitty mustache. Ask him to karaoke, my darling. Yes, they're going in. Wait, where's he going? Where's Jace going? <gasps> Jace just left. Oh no, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Jace just left. Oh no, who's this man? Naoki, okay, we can introduce ourselves to Naoki, but to be honest, I feel like Jace was the right one. This guy is definitely not the right one. Look at that stash, they just keep getting worse. She's gonna bust in his karaoke room, his private room that he probably booked to sing karaoke alone. We need to ask Jace to come somewhere with her. Yes, Jace, we're gonna travel with you. Jace is sleeping? Well, we met Jace. We can go home, we can take it easy, go back to Windenburg. Once it's like normal time to take him out on a date, she'll take him out on a date. Oh, Chelsea's here! <gasps> Tell her, Chelsea, you love her! She's like, it's Grandma Chelsea, what up? Chelsea, we love you, dance with us. Tell Chelsea how much you look up to her as the OG matriarch. Oh, they're not bonding. Okay, well, you know what? Maybe it's time for you to go to bed. I guess Oliver hasn't doesn't have enough time to get all of his homework done today because he's busy helping with the house. He's cleaning up his own pee finally. He let it sit there for hours. All my boys are going to school. Goodbye boys, study hard. Meanwhile, Kelly's taking a nice nap. It might be about eight o'clock. We can go on a date for Kelly once Kelly is sleepy. Chelsea's having a garden salad. What else is new? Even in the afterlife, she stands a salad. Rise and shine, Kelly. The day is young and so are you. In lab, Wesley's science experiment exploded and he made a big mess along with frightening another student. We think he did it on purpose. You know, if, if you really think he did it on purpose, academic punishment seems right. Also, she didn't have another option. So Chase is just, maybe invite him to hang out at the current lot. You don't even have to go out. You can come over to my house. He already knows what's up. Girl met him at a karaoke bar and then is inviting him over to her house at 11 a.m. Yes, Chase is here. <gasps> Hi, Chase. Oh, they gave some little side cheeks kisses. Ask about his day. How's your day been, Jace? Thanks for coming over. He is feeling flirty with this girl. He wants to get to know her. She's giving him a little flirt. See if he likes it. This is the first time she's ever flirted with anyone. <gasps> first kiss, first kiss, first kiss. And who better than Jace to be her first beau? Jace and Kelly are having their very first kiss. It was his first kiss too. <gasps> Wow, hold hands a little bit. Oh, he's, whoa, Jace. Jace, you're a little much. Oh, the OG OTP right behind him looking on. And then girl, I want you to take him up to your bedroom in front of all these bassinets and try for a baby. I'm sure he'll ask and he'll, she'll be like, that's where I'm gonna put all our babies. I'm gonna edit that out probably. Wee, she's going up the stairs, followed him. So many babies have been made in this bedroom, in this very room. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. He has like the most casual PJs too. Oh my God, they're 20. <laughs> okay, I'll let you two be. Have fun. Oh, now they're done. Okay, why don't you take a pregnancy test, Casey? Ah, Kelly. If they don't end up OTP, I bet they'll be lifelong friends. Like I bet she'll still want him to come over and hang out. <gasps> Kelly's first baby. Oh my gosh, she's gonna go tell Jace. You're having a baby with me.
She tells him at the top of the stairs. Give him a residence key. Tell him he can come over whenever he wants. I think that they should be friends. She's gonna give him little kisses on his hands. That's so cute. And give him a house key. Meanwhile, Oliver, Henry, and Holden and Wesley are all getting back from school. Like, who's this dude? Who's in our home? Oh, she's feeling pregnant. Oh, I should get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Okay, I hope Jace comes by. If he never comes by after we gave him the, uh, the keys to the house, he's dead to us. Wesley's standing up, doing his homework, being a good boy as he is. Look at the goodest boy. Why don't we, while she's sleeping downstairs, renovate this bedroom? Obviously, we're gonna keep this OTP next to her. That's that's our mom and dad. That's so cute. Ooh, I like this wall actually. It's kind of cool. This one's kind of cool. I feel like this kind of reminds me of something she might like, or maybe this one, honestly. That one's nice. That's cute. What I'm feeling for this room is like that she just kind of threw some things together. Probably got stuff from all over the place. This would be cute next to the babies. That's where our first baby will go. I like how she ditched some of her mom stuff and then bought secondhand stuff. I think that's a really weird move that I'm, I'm describing, but you no, it's fine. <laughs> Look at Kelly's room. I like it. This feels like a fun vibe for Kelly. I love the little faces on that. Also, I feel like she'd be very eclectic because like, I feel like she'd want to steal half the stuff in her home, you know. Everyone's ready for school today. Woo! Day one as like the matriarch of the home and Kelly has done a fairly good job making everybody, you know, get to work and do their thing. I, w I would like to adult now. I feel like I'm old enough that I should be allowed to go anywhere and do whatever I want. Well, technically, Oliver, you were born before Kelly, so you should be able to do whatever you want now, but you'll always be my baby is what Kelly says. <laughs> Oliver's off to school. She reached parenting level one. Good job, Kelly. Ready to reach parenting level one. We have a day out. We could try to go meet someone and go steal something. Where would be a good place to maybe steal something? Ooh, the estate. Maybe the Von Haunt estate might have something little a little small trinket she can just swipe let's see if there's anything around she can steal can she steal that attempt to swipe go in there go in there kelly no one's around yet try to swipe it this little vase i hope no one shows up <gasps> she did it she swiped her first object we're so proud of you kelly kelly successfully swiped an object without drawing any attention the item can be found in her household inventory Good job, Kelly. Let's see if there's anyone hanging around the grounds. Ooh, here's some people over here. We've got <gasps> Casey. Go go share Casey with the big news. Wait, wait, why are you talking to a flirty Mimsy, the ghost? Do not flirt with Mimsy. We have learned this. This only leads to trouble. She's super proud too. She's like, I just swiped something. I flirted with a ghost and now I'm gonna go tell my mom that I'm pregnant. Hi mom. Share big news. Tell her, tell her your big news that you're pregnant. Mom, mom, pay attention to me, please. Mom, guess what? I'm expecting. Don't talk with these other people. Just talk to me. Mom, I'm expecting. Look at me, mom. Casey, stop being so social and pay attention to your children. Oh, Casey's so happy for her. Oh, she's gonna go pee in a bush. What? Kelly, there's a bathroom here. Why are you doing it like this? Kelly, you're so wild. By now you could have walked to the house. So it is really ridiculous that you did this. She went in, she completely demolished that bush. You're uncomfortable? I thought you just went to the bathroom. You need to go again? She needs to go again. <gasps> Who is this man? Fred Johnson. Jensen, hello Fred Jensen. He is a babe. Ask about his day. Hey Fred, what's your day like? These are the next two dads, by the way. <laughs> They're just standing next to each other, shoulder to shoulder. I'm like, what are you doing here? Henry, you are supposed to be at school. Tell him to go home. What the heck are you doing here? You're supposed to be at school. Oh my gosh, he's that's Henry's father. Go talk to your dad. She's gonna flirt. He is into it. Oh, she looking pregnant. Look at her little Prager's belly. How cute is she? <laughs> Share some big news. Be like, I'm doing a hundred baby challenge. Would you be interested in participating? He's excited for her. He's like, that sounds really great. I'm, pr I'm happy for you. Then make a little flirtation joke. Be like, <laughs> you're next. So let's go home. Let's stop while we're ahead. She's feeling very pregnant. We love that for her. You, sir, Oliver, you need to do your homework, sir, because you are behind. Meanwhile, Wesley, who is 
being perfect while we see if we have a cake for you. Yes, we do. We do have a cake for you, Wesley. Wesley, Wesley, Wesley. Here he comes. He's the birthday boy. He's super miserable. He's going to be so cute when he's a teen. I can't wait to see teen hold in. Wesley aged up. Random. He's a glutton like his mother before him. Pick a number one through 12. The answer is two. Two, so he wants to be athletic. Interesting, okay, very similar to his mom. Maybe he'll be an athlete that was super smart and wears a bow tie. He's got a bit of a high hairline for a teen. Still looks a little dorky. Okay, now that we're home, let's look at the inventory to see what she stole. She stole an it's not an urn, is it? It says the end urn. Elegant simplicity of this urn. <gasps> she stole an urn. Oh my God, and I think she's gonna, I'm gonna sell it through $290. That's almost as much as like one of her sisters when they had a job. So if we just go out and steal one thing a day, it's like having a job. That is terrible that she stole this and I'm gonna sell it. Oh my gosh, we're gonna make so much money just from selling stuff that's just sitting in our inventory. This is great. This is what I should have been doing this whole time. Oh my gosh, that's like $1,800 in plates, spice rack, that's $500? Great, wow, we are at 85,000. Not too shabby for our girl. Homework's complete by Henry and Holden. Good job. Oliver, I think you should do extra credit just to make sure that you age up tomorrow because I think it's time for you to be an adult <laughs> at long last. Oh no, sleeping in the hot tub again. Stop sleeping in this hot tub, kids. Don't do it. She's making herself a grilled cheese. Apparently it might be a pregnancy craving. She's not having a salad. Oh no, 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 no. Kelly, good for you. She reached level two of the cooking skill. Kelly's first new skill as a mom that she's gonna be using. Now she's running to the bathroom. What's she gonna do? Oh, she's gonna throw up. Oh no. Oh, oh, that was a little too. Oh girl, you know you're gonna have to clean that now. Why are you dancing? She's dancing in front of the toilet. There's no music in here. <gasps> it's Harvest Fest. Oh my gosh, it's Kelly's first Harvest Fest, this matriarch. She's gonna have to throw the big dinner and she can hardly cook. <laughs> oh my gosh. They've come. Where are the gnomes? They left as soon as they arrived. Gnome Quest 2020. <gasps> there they are. They're in the bathroom. Oh my gosh, there's four of them. This one's naked, this one's in swimming gear. This one's just on a rock. Honestly, I feel like being pregnant's probably pretty uncomfortable. Whoa! Okay, they all moved. Ah, they moved again. Where did they go? Okay, three of them are in the bathroom. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Ooh, Wesley earned a dance skill. Our little angel so, grew up so awkward. Look at that. Maybe Wesley deserves a makeover. Maybe we could help him out. This is first attempt wasn't quite right. Doesn't feel like his personality. Hair wise, just not loving this hair for him. You know what? No, I like I like this one. Little Archie Andrews kind of vibes. Is this his look for every day? Oh, I'm really glad I'm giving him a makeover. This is bad. This is very, very bad. Or he could do another bow tie like he did when he was a kid. Or like this. This is cute. Oh, you can hear my stomach growl. It's garden salad time very soon. Just wait. That one's okay. You know, I don't mind the boot that they say. That's fine. Cute. <laughs> my stomach is having a fun day. We redid hit Wesley. He looks a little better now. It's 3 p.m., which honestly, that's about the time where I normally have my holiday for Thanksgiving. Yeah, we'll have a dinner party. The host is obviously gonna be Kelly, but Oliver and Wesley can kind of host too. The guests are gonna be Henry, Holden, Elliot and Petra Schmay, obviously Casey and Petra Schmay, Chelsea Jr., Hannah, Connor, Blake, Fred can come. Writer, Jace is also gonna come. Caterer, caterer's gonna be Casey, or Kelly. Let's have you cook a turkey dinner. It's a classic. It's her first time. She's probably gonna wanna do the classic. Oh my gosh, Jace is over. Hi, Jace. Oh, why he's angry. Jace shows up angry and I don't love that for us. But oh my gosh, look how cute Hannah looks in her little overalls. Her dad's coming. Oh my gosh, oop, they just moved. 
She's saying hi and thanking everyone for coming. Oh, she's singing for Harvest Fest with her first dad and her dad. He's meeting the father. He's like, dag, dag, I'm the one that impregnated your daughter. Boy, your mom is making dinner and you are on the stove making yourself whatever this is. Mac and cheese. You gotta finish your turkey dinner. Stop talking to Connor. Resume your dinner. What are you doing? Oh, well, I mean, he's up here. Oh, she's giving him a little kiss. Is. Have a little, have a little flirt with him while you're upstairs alone with him. Well, I mean, since she's a little distracted, I think that we're gonna go back downstairs and have Oliver finish up. You, you do the turkey dinner. Help your mom. Kelly's gonna talk. Oh no! Why did everything get embarrassing up in here? Okay, that did not go well. Maybe he's just uncomfortable because they talked once and then she invited him to dinner with her entire family. Like that's, I guess, understandable, right? Oh my God! They're both wearing red dresses for. <laughs> This is so cute. Casey. Casey and Kelly are matching. And Kelly's like, how does it feel being the pregnant one in the red dress? Is the turkey dinner done? He's still waiting on it. Oh my gosh. It's 8 p.m. I thought that we'd have it done by now. I guess we should have started a little earlier, huh? Kelly. Oh no, Kelly. I wonder if she just took like a little nap. Oh, she's feeling uncomfortable. Dinner is served. Oh, it's right here? What the heck? Okay, everyone's having dinner though, so that's good. Don't eat outside in the rain. Why are you outside in the rain? Go back inside. No, what did you do? She's standing outside in the rain alone. I thought it was a pretty good holiday. Wesley's having a nice time. He finished up the food really pretty well. Uh, Henry's, you know, enjoying chatting with his, his older sisters. Oliver's obviously asleep as usual. Oh my gosh, they're all in the bathroom again. Oh no, <gasps> she's gonna pass out. We got a pregnant lady down. She like walked into the middle of all of her friends and this guy, <gasps> he checked out her butt when she passed out. Roll it back. <laughs> Middle of all of her friends and this guy. <gasps> oh no, she's passing out again. On her way to bed, she just is gone. She's out. There she is. She's gonna go to bed now. Good job. Oh, Harvest Fest successful. Oh, Henry's was awful and Holden's was awful. Kelly's was fine and Wesley's was successful. Well, we did a, do a decent job, you know? Most of the family had a good Harvest Fest. Not all of them, but yeah, you need to skill up to level three. You were actually pretty good at cooking. Well, serve a quick meal, scrambled eggs with bacon. That's lovely. He's like moving around all these, all these gnomes. Maybe we need to put the gnomes somewhere else. Put them in the backyard. The gnomes will go out here. They don't need to be watching the fridge the whole time. They can they can chill out here. He's doing a good job. I think he'll get to level three today. Yay, Wesley reached cooking level three. Good job, Wesley. Good job, buddy. School starts for everyone in an hour, which means it's Kelly time. Time for Kelly to talk to Fred and figure out what his deal is. Just waiting for Fred to show up. <gasps> Fred's here. I'm trying to calm him down. Wait, what? He's like stressed? Oh, he's angry. Oh. Maybe this dude's toxic. He took a deep breath. <gasps> she calmed him down. Well, that's kind of sweet, actually. You know, he was having a bad day. It's okay to have a bad day. It's not okay to be toxic. Oh, she giving him a foot massage. Uh, the old MPJK standby. She just acquired the wellness skill. She's not super great at the foot massage. Maybe she'll train up, become a better foot masseuse. Oh my gosh, Chase is here. <laughs> Jace just came over, he's like, hey, what's up? Ask about his day. Oh no, what if Jace comes down and she's flirting with him and they have it and he gets jealous? What would happen? It would be terrible. Flirt with him again. I love she's eating eggs, is super pregnant, flirting up a storm with this man. Oh, he's heading out. Dang it. Well, that's okay. We, we laid some good groundwork. Jace just came down, he missed all of it. Girl, go to the bathroom. Do not pee your pants. <gasps> she's in labor! Yes, let's go. Kelly, go to the hospital. It's Kelly's first babies. <laughs> She's at the hospital and who is it? But of course, Theo Beckett, Casey's doctor is still here. Hi, Theo Beckett. Oh my gosh, she's in her very wow. first hospital gown. Look at her. She's she's so scared and worried. It's her first pregnancy. Oh my goodness. Here she goes in the weird contraption that's very aggressive. Anticipation. Okay, here we go. That was that's gross. 
Ew, they just took it. It took her heart out. What the heck? Don't kill her. What are you doing, Theo? Oh my gosh, Theo, step it up. Stop botching this. Twins, twins, twins. It's a girl. Her first baby is a girl, which means, of course, I get to go to old 100 baby challenge episodes and look at your guys' comments to see what you would like this baby to be named. For a boy, is Zayner Hudson, girl Josie, my name, or Ivy? I love the name Josie, so we're definitely going to use your name, Josie. Thank you so much for commenting and watching the videos. It is Josie and Peach May. Welcome to the family. <gasps> yes, double girls! Heck yeah, heck yeah, it's another girl! Which means we need another name. This one's cute, it says for a girl, Cove. Cove and Peter Schmay, welcome to the family. I feel like Kate, uh, Kelly would have some like cool hipster names. So we are two new babies, which means we have officially hit 69 babies. <laughs> Look at her first baby. Oh my God, uh -huh. Kelly's a mother. I think this looks good on her. I think she's gonna be a great mom. And you did not help Theo, none for you. Oh, she swiped something in front of him and he caught her. Oh no, get out of there, Kelly. Kelly, you know you're not supposed to steal stuff when other people are around. Well. That concludes the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so proud of Kelly and her first two new twin baby girls. Make sure as always to comment below your 100 baby names. I highly recommend to just comment one or two because those are the comments that I normally choose. And until next time, I'll see you next week. Bye. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching the 100 Baby Challenge. If you're interested, make sure to hit that subscribe button, leave a like, or check out some of our other videos.